A nurse at Mobile Infirmary found herself fighting for her life during this pandemic. We previously told you about Karen Parker, who spent 83 days in the hospital. NBC 15's Andrea Ramey reports on how the nurse is doing tonight. Karen Parker, a Mobile Infirmary nurse, turned patient early on in the pandemic. One week after she started running a fever, she was fighting to breathe and rushed to the ER. In a recording produced by the hospital, she shared those daunting moments. I knew when I went in the hospital, I looked at my husband, I knew I wouldn't be seeing him for a while, but I didn't realize how long ooh, that while was going to be. After that, I don't remember anything until five weeks later. And that's when my husband said, you know, I, w I had been intubated three times, and then they ended up doing a trach on me. By her bedside, Dr. Adrian DiVittorio, who recorded a song for her to uplift her spirits. It was beautiful, it really was, that he would take that time to do that. With a hero send-off, colleagues lined the halls and gathered outside as she was wheeled out of the hospital, discharged after fighting for her life for 83 days. Everybody thinks they're invincible. I'm not going to get this. You know, people won't get the flu shot because I'm just not going to get the flu. It always seems to take everybody by surprise when they get it, even though they've been warned about it. You take all the um, precautions that you're supposed to take and you still get it. There's nothing, you know, nothing you can do about it. You just got to roll with the punches and, and, and fight it. Karen hopes by sharing her struggle with COVID-19, those who aren't taking it seriously will now. Andrea Ramey, NBC 15 News. Right now, Karen is going through physical therapy to get stronger and hopefully soon be able to walk without a walker.